Would people be less scared of dying if we had concrete proof of what happened after we die? People might be more scared if they found out it was excruciatingly painful. 100 depends on what they know. Hell? Heaven? Eternal nothingness? I think so, like if we knew that you just started over, people would probably commit suicide more. Not if what happens next is really really bad. Stephen King wrote a story called Revival where, after death, everyone gets tortured for all eternity by a giant Lovecraftian being and her servant of ant-like demons. The story ends with the protagonist realizing that, no matter what they do, eventually they will die and be forced to serve the being. So if I knew that was coming I would be quite a bit more scared of death than I am now. I'm not scared of death at all. I'm scared of how I might die and the pain associated with that in my final moments. I hate to be cynical here, but cults that have people genuinely believe in some form of afterlife or something similar to that have killed themselves to reach that fantasy. As some random guy on the internet who knows nothing about anything, I think knowing what happens after death would lead to more death. No, because some asshole would figure out a way to monetize it. Absolutely. I'm terrified of dying and sometimes spiral into an anxiety attack if I think about it. I wish we knew what happened after. If what happens is that you go to heaven or you reincarnate in another person, yes. If what happens is there's nothing after death or you go to hell, no. I mean if hell actually exists, I think it would stigma fear in people again, and people wanting to make sure they walk through the gates. So like, it could go 50-50. I know what happens to me. If my family follows my wishes, I am going to be turned into mulch and used to plant a tree somewhere in the us. Fear of death is not a choice, it's an instinct. I don't think so. Same as when we experience any life-changing event, there will be some fear and apprehension. Even if we know the outcome, change in any form is scary. It's animal instinct to seek survival whether we're aware of it or not. Millions of years of evolution basically programmed the instinct into us. No. In fact it makes it more terrifying for some. Do you remember what life was like before you were born? Cause that'll be what it's like after you die, and to some, that is the scariest outcome. If there's a confirmed afterlife, potentially. If it's a confirmed eternal empty void of consciousness, no, that scares me more than hell. You should watch interviews with people who have had an NDE, some of them have completely lost their fear of death. I have found it very comforting to hear what they say. I have no fear of death, I have much more fear of a life not truly lived. Enjoy each day, and when your time comes, welcome death with open arms. We have proof of what happens. The electric activity in the brain stops, so it doesn't work anymore. That's it. I think that people don't necessarily have a fear of dying as much as the process of dying. We could have concrete evidence of what happens next, but that wouldn't stop us from fearing the process. It's like jumping off a cliff, are you scared of actually jumping or of chilling on the water? I'm not afraid of death, but I don't believe there's anything after. If we got a concrete proof that there's, for example, reincarnation, I'd get scared for sure. I'd fear it less if there was something after. On a serious note, I think believing in an afterlife is solely due to our incapability of understanding the concept of not existing. More specifically, I think our brain biologically has a huge blind spot when it comes to imagining scenarios where the brain has been destroyed. It's incomprehensible. Because you were created, there is a non-zero chance you will be recreated likely after the death and rebirth of the universe ad infinitum that becomes 100 guaranteed throughout infinite time. It is with this logic, I am assuaged. Some people experience death in the same way their loved ones experience his or her death. It's a painful loss knowing they won't ever be able to hold or kiss their children, see the ocean, etc. rather than fear of burning in hell or whatever. Probably. I feel like the main reason people are afraid to die is besides not being with loved ones, or not being able to do things you once did that we don't know what's next. There are millions of possible scenarios, but we won't ever be able to know unless we die of course. 
the ambiguity can be terrifying. You go back to being stardust, and I ain't scared of that. Just wanna enjoy the moment still. I mean, from a scientific perspective we kinda already do. When you die the person that is you will cease to exist as a conscious being, and will remain in that state of non-existence for eternity. Your body will eventually decompose and cease to exist as well. Well, I am pretty sure to know about what will happen after death. Nothing. It's just the process of dying scaring the shit out of me. And thinking about the hole you will leave behind. But, yeah, I think too few PPL think about how long it takes to pass on, and how painful it could be. Depends on if we knew what happened afterwards and if that's scary or not. That's what DMT is for. For some people yes, even if it's a hell-like situation they are looking into, it's been proven that some people would rather have bad but predictable than insecurity and the unknown. For me it highly depends on what happens after death. I'm a bit of a nihilist, so I believe there is nothing on the other side. If I were to learn that there is an afterlife I think it would impact the way I like at life entirely. There are always the skeptics. It would vary. I've had anxiety attacks over the thought of death, and no matter what I try to imagine comes after, I would not calm down. It depends on on what we know. I go into an existential crisis just thinking about non-existence. I am not scared of dying. I am scared of what will happen to the people I care about after I am gone. I am scared of dying a painful death if I died fighting for oxygen or something. I suspect it depends on what we'd have concrete proof of. I think more people would commit suicide if they knew what was next. That depends on what exactly that thing is. If it really is just a void of nothingness, no more existence, that would make my anxiety of death even worse. For me the fact it's unknown makes it at least a little bit easier to not worry about 24-7, but when my ADHD thoughts come in the middle of the night, I do get terrible panic attacks thinking about it. If the proof said that it all just becomes black I believe most people still would be scared. The fear of death or dying isn't always about what is on the other side. For me I don't fear death itself, I fear what will happen to the ones I leave behind. Will they be okay? Will they really remember the love I have for them? The value of life would drop tremendously. Just like it does the more religious you get. I'm not scared of dying. I'm scared of missing out on the lives of those around me and not finishing shit. We do. Absolutely nothing and you're not conscious of the nothing because the organ which interrupts external stimuli is dead too. What it's like after you die is exactly like it was before you were born. Many Christians do not fear death for this very reason. Of course, they don't have proof though. Just faith. Thing is, we know what happens after we die. There is zero evidence for a soul. Our mind is evidently a product of our brain chemistry. After death, our body just stops, our consciousness ceases and that's that. Based on the evidence, that's what happens after that. I'm not exactly scared of dying but it does make the one and only life I get that much more valuable. There are no second chances. This life is all we'll get. Again, we know this to be true, based on the evidence. Damn this thread is full of religious people trying to convince other people there has to be an afterlife. If it is believed that the universe is so big. Who's to say? Our conscious soul may end up floating off to another part of the universe and exist there. We may end up ceasing to exist in this dimension and move to another. There is way too much we don't know about in general to ever get to the point of all knowing. Might as well just go to the Winchester, have a nice cold pint, and wait for this all to blow over. I'd say so even if it's not great after we die at least we could mentally prepare for it rather than being scared of the unknown. Although personally I'm not scared of death I've accepted the likely outcome that it's a whole lot of nothing. For me, absolutely. It's the same reason I'm terrified of the ocean, we don't know everything that's in there since 80 of the ocean is unexplored. If I knew what was in the ocean, I wouldn't be as terrified. Same goes with death. 